here's how you graph linear functions in slope-intercept form. This equation is slope-intercept form. The m represents the slope, and the b represents the y-intercept. And when you graph these, you always start with the y-intercept first, and then do the rise over the run with the slope. So let's go down to this example. So let's identify the slope first. The slope is 3 over 2. So we're going to rise 3 in a positive direction and run 2 in a positive direction. And then our y-intercept is negative 6. So we're going to start at over 0 down 6 on the y-axis. So here's our y-axis. We're going to graph the ordered pair over 0, down 6. So here's down 2, down 4, down 6. So that ordered pair is 0, negative 6. Now we're going to construct our slope from that point. So we're going to rise 3 from the green ordered pair. So we're going to rise 1, 2, 3, and then we're going to run 2 in a positive direction, in a horizontal. And what we're going to do is we're going to create a new ordered pair right there. Now we're going to rise 3 again from that blue ordered pair. 1, 2, 3, and then we're going to run 2 in a positive direction and create a new ordered pair in the red. And what we have is a couple ordered pairs now that were created from this original green ordered pair. Now we can construct our line. Ryan Soto, please come to the main office. So now we have our line. 